The refresh process was developed to confirm the 3M ScaleGuard FSTM075 reverse osmosis filtration system is installed correctly and is delivering water to your equipment that meets the correct water specification. Prior to actual installation and use of any 3M product, it is important to read and understand the product installation and use instruction manual. This video will take you through the refresh process step by step to confirm the RO system is installed correctly and performing to specification. Step 1. Check to see if the RO unit is bypassed. If yes, please contact the manager or owner for instructions on how to proceed. If the RO is not bypassed, please proceed to Step 2. Step 2. Measure the TDS of the tap water in the RO outwater. Use a pocket TDS meter. Is the tap water less than or equal to 100 TDS? If yes, the RO unit is optional at this site. Contact the manager or owner for instructions on how to proceed. If no, proceed to Step 3. Step 3. Test and record RO feed water pressure. Use any standard water pressure gauge supplied by the service technician. 60 to 100 PSI recommended. Step 4. Check to confirm that the RO unit is installed correctly. Please check each of the following. 1. Tap water connected to inlet valve. 2. Flow restrictor tubing, SFC tubing, installed in drain fitting on RO membrane cartridge. Drain line connected to flow restrictor and connected to drain. 3. Water sample valve installed correctly on the RO water equipment line. 4. RO water equipment line connected to food service equipment. 5. Tank connected and tank ball valve in the open position. 6. Schrader air valve. Empty water from RO tank, then set to 8 to 10 PSI air pressure. If the RO is not installed according to the installation checklist, make all necessary corrections to the installation and then proceed to Step 5 and complete a preventative maintenance on the RO unit. If the RO unit is installed according to the installation checklist, proceed to Step 5 and complete preventative maintenance on the RO unit. The demonstration shown in this video is intended to provide an overview of the preventative maintenance required for the 3M ScaleGuard FSTM075 reverse osmosis water filtration system. Prior to actual installation and use of any 3M product, it is important to read and understand the product installation and use instruction manual. First, shut down the FSTM075 system. 
Close the inlet water valve and shut off valve in the equipment line if one is installed. Then empty the tank. Divert the water sample valve to a bucket or drain and open the valve. Drain until the water flow stops. To remove the pre-filter cartridge, turn it one quarter turn to the left and pull it down. Then test and adjust the air charge in the tank. First, locate the Schrader air valve on the tank and remove the blue cap. Using a standard pressure gauge to read the tank air pressure, adjust the air pressure to 8 to 10 psi. Then replace the blue cap on the Schrader valve. It is necessary to change the pre-filter cartridge every year during your annual preventative maintenance. To install a new pre-filter cartridge, remove the red cap and moisten the O-rings with water. Insert the new pre-filter cartridge into the pre-filter head. Be sure the ears on the new cartridge line up with the spaces in the head. Turn the new cartridge one quarter turn to the right until it stops. Mark the installation date using a permanent marker on the new pre-filter cartridge. Change the RO membrane cartridge every other year during preventative maintenance. Remove the RO membrane cartridge by turning it one quarter turn to the left and pulling down. Remove the red SFC tubing with the drain line connected from the cartridge drain fitting. To install the new RO membrane cartridge, remove the one quarter inch plug from the cartridge drain fitting. Insert the red SFC tube with the drain line connected into the drain fitting. Moisten the O-rings with water and insert the new RO membrane cartridge into the RO membrane cartridge head. Be sure the ears on the new cartridge line up with the spaces in the cartridge head. Turn the new RO membrane cartridge one quarter turn to the right until it stops. Mark the installation date using a permanent marker on the new RO membrane cartridge. To restart the RO system, divert the water sample valve to a bucket or drain. Open the inlet water valve and allow the water to flush from the water sample valve according to the instructions included on the product performance data sheet. After flushing, close the water sample valve and open the shutoff valve in the equipment line if one is installed. Check for leaks and repair as necessary. Next, using a TDS meter, test the TDS in the feed water to the FSTM 075RO system. Note the feed water TDS. In this case, it's 299 parts per million. Measure the TDS of the RO water produced by the FSTM 075RO system. Here, the RO product water TDS is 15 parts per million. Using the equation below, calculate the percent reduction of the FSTM 075RO system. Allow the FSTM 075RO unit to operate for 60 minutes to fill the tank and cycle off before operating the food service connected to the FSTM 075RO. This completes the overview of the preventative maintenance required for the 3M ScaleGuard FSTM 075 reverse osmosis water filtration system. For additional annual maintenance procedures, please refer to the installation and use instruction manual.